We are so excited about the NCAA championships for both the men and the women. We saw what happened with the women last year, all the drama that unfolded between Baylor and Stanford. I fully expect that we're going to see that again. Match play just brings that out. I love yeah, it. it. It does, and Eugene Country Club is going to be such it's a awesome. great test in the back nine, or which is actually Eugene's front nine. They flipped it for this championship. So you're going to see a lot of drama, some some drivable holes, some some reachable par fives, some short par threes. It's going to be a great diversity. And we've seen a lot of parity in the women's college game this year. So it's really anyone's guess who's going to win this championship. As last year showed, match play, really anything can happen as well. Yeah, and the golf course too, you, when you talk about you're setting up too, it's, it's a lot more gallery friendly than we've seen in the last couple of years too. So, I mean, the, the, the holes are just sort of back and forth. So people, families, and other teams will be able to jump back and forth. I think it'll have a lot, a, a pretty neat little atmosphere to it. That place is awesome. Played it a couple of years ago in October with the leaves changing. Oh, How'd you play? It is That's not well. That's all you do is play well, golf. But, well, I mean, look, before here, you were talking about where the, you're playing. That was off the record, I want to come back as you. Uh, <laughs> some predictions. It's surprising because Duke hasn't really been playing well. USC's been playing well. Stanford wasn't playing well to start. Now they're really starting to turn it up. You're our guru here. Give us some insight. U U USC is probably the favorite, but I would put them just slightly over Alabama. Alabama has five yeah. players inside yeah. the top 80 individually, which is what you're looking for, depth one through five. You can have a star like Emma Talley at the top of your lineup, but you also need that five player to come in and post a good number or win a, win a crucial match when it comes down to match play. Yeah, it starts with those two, and you know that somebody, though, that nobody's thinking about is going to jump up there and get in that top eight. And meet Nobody would have right thought eight. it'd be Baylor, Baylor a year ago. So there, there will be a Baylor type this year. Did you see that? You hear be? me throw that in there? What's that? I said Arkansas Razorbacks. Oh. Not being biased I didn't hear that. No Gabby Lopez, Lise. No Gabby Lopez. That's all right. They're loaded, too. We'll see.